The overall goal of this procedure is to isolate Colobacter swarmer cells in order to establish a synchronized cell culture. This is accomplished by first growing a mixed culture of Colobacter cells and then briefly arresting growth by resuspending the cells in cold medium. The second step is to separate the swarmer cells through differential density centrifugation. The next step is to resuspend the swarmer cells in warm medium, which allows the cells to enter the cell cycle. Finally, the isolated swarmer cells can be followed throughout the cell cycle by using biochemical assays or microscopy. The main advantage of this technique over other methods such as the baby cell machine is that cells can be isolated quickly and in large enough quantities for biochemical studies. This method can help answer key questions in the cell biology field such as what controls chromosome segregation and the asymmetric cell division cycle. To begin, inoculate 5 milliliters of PYE medium with bacteria from a plate of Colobacter crescentis strain NA1000. Grow the culture overnight at 28 degrees Celsius with shaking. The following day, transfer 0.5 milliliters of the overnight culture to a flask containing 25 milliliters of M2G medium and shake the flask at 28 degrees Celsius until the culture reaches an optical density between 0.5 and 0.6. Next, dilute the culture into 1 liter of M2G medium to obtain the desired starting optical density and shake the flask at 28 degrees Celsius. When the optical density of the culture reaches 0.5, pipette 1 microliter of the culture onto a slide and then cover the liquid with a cover slip. Image the cells by phase microscopy.